The following program is video supplemental instruction. VSI is brought to you by the Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu. Question 3 says the pitch of a musical note is governed by which parameter of the sound wave? So it gives you five different choices. Frequency, amplitude, shape of the wave, wavelength, and speed. Uh, this class, they, they touch on waves, but they don't go into it a lot. So you'll have some equations and stuff, but they definitely like you to know the definitions of all the terms that have to do with waves. If you know the definition of frequency and you understand what it is, I mean, outside the fact that it's just the inverse of the period is the number of uh, seconds per oscillation, then you realize that when you're concerned with music or sounds of any sort, frequency just, that's what defines the pitch. That's just the definition of how pitch is defined is by frequency. This is truly a question of guessing or trying to figure out if you actually read the book or listened to them in class. Um, the amplitude definitely has nothing to do with frequency. Amplitude tells you how loud it's going to be, which hopefully by just the definition of the word amplitude, that kind of makes sense to you. It's just how loud the sound's going to be. Amp you can have the same exact wave with different amplitudes. shape of the wave that's more dealing with the transverse versus longitudinal waves, you have your compression waves and stuff, it has nothing to do with the pitch. Okay, um, the speed of the wave, that's, that can help you determine how the relationship between the wavelength and the frequency is, but the speed of the wave, once again, just has nothing to do with the pitch. The only trick would be wavelength, because um, certain pitches have different wavelengths, but those wavelengths are kind of determined by the medium at which the wave is traveling through, and it basically the wavelength kind of defines the resonant frequencies in a musical instrument, but the frequency still determines the pitch. So, just got to know the definition of frequency is for this question. No other way around it. The Teaching Center, UF's Learning Support Center, www.teachingcenter.ufl.edu.